hey guys welcome back so in this video we are going to see about how to solve this browser error that we are facing in selenium so this is the error that it tells that could not start a new session response code is 500 and message it indicates that session create the this version of chrome driver only supports chrome version 114 so a uh, very few might have been facing this issue in recent times this is because the chrome driver has a different version than chrome so first thing what you have to do is go to settings so i'll open a new tab and click on settings in about chrome see so check whether your chrome is updated and here the version is 12106 this is a version it's showing for me and it's up to date but the version that chrome driver supports is some other version to solve this issue just go to selenium official website directly go to chrome driver uh, official website and you can see your uh, browser uh, version and accordingly you can download the chrome driver and here you can see it has been highlighted if you are using chrome version 115 or newer please consult the chrome for testing availability dashboard this page provides convenient json endpoint for specific chrome driver version downloading either you can directly go from here or you can go to selenium official web page and click on downloads and scroll down here you can see browsers click on browsers and choose which browser you are using i'll go to this chrome documentation and it'll just direct me to the same page so here i will just click on this uh, the chrome testing which was given here in red color i'm just clicking that here you will get the version which matches your chrome browser so from here we are will be downloading so click on stable and here you can see chrome driver uh, and according to your systems and download so mine was windows 64 so i'll just copy this link and paste it here so i have already downloaded and once again it is downloading so i'll not be considering that so once you have downloaded with the version that you wanted you can just go to your downloads folder and here i have already downloaded so i'll just click on that downloads folder here you can see that chrome driver exe so just copy that chrome driver exe and wherever you have so i have renamed this to old actually this i have replaced with that so i'll just rename this to chrome driver itself so that is my old chrome driver and this is my new chrome driver so what i do is once after copying the exe file i'm just showing you which i have already done so copy that chrome driver and wherever you have created a folder for your project mine was in d drive and inside project code i have selenium basic and here inside my driver i have two things one is the old version and now which i have pasted so this wherever you have created the my driver thing just go paste it there so once you have pasted just refresh this entire project so you will get the chrome driver here and now you can just change the name so i have given chrome driver save and reload now you can see the error is gone so this avoid because that's some other error which i have not commented here okay that's some other error but the actual error is been removed okay so if you want i can just cut this code and save once again and run it so you can see you are redirected to that data tables and you have no errors go to your console so you can just go to windows 
so view console you have no errors thank you for watching like share and subscribe to the channel we'll see you guys in the next video